Lisa. We are on house party waiting for my father to recite some doa because we're supposed to have a kenduri today but because ah uh, hmm, because of the circuit breaker so tak dapatlah pergi kenduri but my mother um delivered some um, food so we all get to eat tulang later on Alhamdulillah and then we just going to recite doa together as a family uh, with house party Reza Hey guys, what's up? So today is the third day of the circuit breaker and I just like to document this period of time through vlogging. Um, it hasn't been easy for me today. I think because it's the weekend and it's, it is supposed to be a long weekend and before all this happened, um, my mom already made plans to have a a feast, uh, a small feast um, together as a family to celebrate the coming of Ramadan and also you know just um, a general like majlis kesyukuran like that you know kenduri doa selamat and tahlil um, so we didn't get to do that uh, and so we we did the next best thing. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alamin. Syukur kita kepada Allah yang telah kita dapat berkumpul walaupun dengan keadaan teknologi baru dengan video dan keadaan sekarang adalah keadaan darurat. Which was to um do a hangout. What's that? What's that app called? House party. So we use this house party app. Um, and my father would uh, recite the doa and all that and then um, my mom actually delivered the bone steak and the fried chicken and the sweet and sour prawn um, over to my house just now just so that we can have um, you know a taste of what she cooks for today so um yeah and we all sat around together in front of our screens and we all um ate together like a family only that um it's you know through uh through the computer screens um it's not ideal <laughs> and i realize how much i miss going out and seeing my parents and all that I think it's been over two weeks since I last saw them uh, I mean last meet meet up with them and then uh, with my in-laws I think it was much longer um, and it's I think it's worse for Fauzi and Reza because like for me circuit breaker only started um, as of three days ago but for Fauzi and Reza, it, it's much longer because um, like Reza hasn't been to school since the school March holidays. Uh, we just decided to not send him. And then Fauzi has been taking care of uh, Reza. So um, I think they've not, <laughs> they've not gone out for like, what, four weeks. And for me, it's only been three days and already I'm having so much uh, anxiety and 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 uh it, it's not easy for me 
You cannot play. Where's Cubby? Where's Cubby the best? No, you cannot. No, no. Please, come here, come here. No, cannot. This is a pointy pen. Tak boleh, sayang. Uh, the I think that the part that's been quite challenging was the working from home and the focus, I guess. Um, so it was, you know, because Reza is is a handful and he's like constantly wanting attention and all that. So like whenever I try to sit down in front of the computer to do some work and all that, he'll be crying at the background so that has been um, a little bit frustrating in the beginning um, so we're all trying to um, make it work but all in all I think um, to put a positive spin on it um, I feel like I've been given time um, to be with my family more my you know in in the sense that you know, before all this happens, I'm always, um, I always wish that, uh, that I have the opportunity or the option or the freedom to work from home. Um, and, you know, I hate commuting to work. So, like, working from home is kind of like my idea of the, my ideal lifestyle, you know, so, and I've always been like, I wish I have more time with my family. I, I have more flexibility when it comes to work. I can work from home, you know. So I've always kind of wants that. So and I feel like now I've been I've been given that opportunity. So I really cannot complain, um, as in being home. I, there are challenges and there are. You know, in the beginning there were a bit of frustration and all that, but it's still it's still a privilege to be to be given this chance because I know that there are some people who do not even have that opportunity. You know, essential workers and even my um, fellow teachers who works in a childcare who has to come back to work and um, still continue. Uh, doing their jobs our unsung heroes who has to go out every day and make sure that we are alright so I, I really have nothing to complain about except for just being restless at home and I hope that um, that we all can go back to our normal routine and working lives uh, you know our normal lifestyles can go on so that's all for today um i hope you guys are doing okay stay safe stay home because that's the only way to flatten the curve and hopefully inshallah um we will get through this and all this will resolve quickly yep bye